that's enough of that. Um, the, uh, the goal, as I said in the last video, is to embed a link to a YouTube video in an angel page. And I did that in the previous video in version 7.1, but it looks a little different uh, in 7.2. So I'm in a 7.2 course space now, and I want to create an embedded video. So to start the process from the beginning, I'm going to go to YouTube and find a video. And so I see the, the video that I want here, um, but I also see all these other things down along the sides here, and maybe my students will find them distracting, or I don't want those in my course. So I just want this video. So the first thing I'm going to do is um, copy this embed statement here. I'm going to right-click and copy and go into my course. And the first thing I'm going to do is create a page for that embed code to live in. And I'm going to go to the Manage tab to Course Files Manager. And in the associated content, I am going to add a folder and call it, um, I'll call it vids for videos. And then inside the vids folder, I'm going to create a page for that video, the one for adding Mer from Merlo. So I'll call this one merlo.htm. And I'll paste that code from YouTube into there. So I now have a page in, in Angel that just has an embedded video and doesn't have all the other stuff. So now I want to link to this page, and I'm going to link to it using a... Um, uh, instead of using a link, I'm going to be using a token. And that token will look like this. It will be course path, associated files, and make that folder called vids, and then merlo.htm. And this, what this is going to do is it's going to tell Angel to look not at a specific place in the Angel database, but in the in the course where it currently resides, the path for that course in the associated files. So that way, if I if I move that content from one course to another, the link should still work. All right. So over in my let's say I want to put this video in a an announcement. So I'm going to go to the Communicate tab and create a new announcement. And this is, this is the part where it's significantly different from 7.1. In 7.3, we have the inline editor here. And so the first thing I need to do is um, put some text in for my announcements. And to do that, I'm going to select this text. And I'm going to use the, uh, the web link button here. And I'm going to change my protocol from hypertext to other, or none. And then paste in that token, same as I did before. And again, it's just uh, course path slash asoc slash the name of my folder and the name of my file. And hit save. And now if I go out to the uh, home page here, hit refresh, make sure I've got the right one up there, and click the link, voila, there it is.